Hello Capricorn, welcome to a reading all about how your person is currently thinking or feeling about you. As always, it is meant to be a general love reading, so we're not resonating with every Capricorn watching. Take what resonates to, for you, what applies to your situation. All right, let's get into this for Capricorn. Regards to love spirit, what does Capricorn need to know? about the person they're in a connection with at this time. This will be for those of you who already are in some sort of a connection or are um, have someone in mind, as I should say, for Capricorn spirit. What does Capricorn need to know when it comes to love? What does Capricorn need to know? All right, spirit, let's see. It's really hard to shuffle, but I love the artwork of this deck. Okay, so let's see. Huge thank you to everyone who has liked, shared, commented, and subscribed. I really appreciate it. And we'll get right into this. So let's look at how your person is thinking or feeling about you, Capricorn. Spirit, how's this person thinking or feeling about Capricorn at this time? The person that Capricorn is in a connection with, what are their thoughts or feelings towards Capricorn at this time? Ace of Swords reversed. Yikes. Either words were exchanged between you or there was some sort of deception here. What else? What are their thoughts or feelings towards Capricorn at this time? Oh, the Magician. So they're trying to manifest something when it comes to you. Or thinking about it, at least. What else we have this one? What other messages do you have? That's too many. What are they thinking or feeling about Capricorn at this time? The wheel reversed. Okay, so it's probably just not the right time or um, your person's going to hit some snags. Maybe they feel like they're unlucky, like nothing works out for them, like, um, like they're constantly against the current, you know, when it comes to achieving a goal with you. With Ace of Swords reverse and the wheel reverse, I feel like these two are connected in some way, almost like someone's deception or bad communication has led to an unlucky situation. So let's get some more insight here. I'm going to use my homemade deck to get some more insight into how this person is thinking or feeling. Spare any more insight for Capricorn? regarding this person they are thinking about at this time. The other insight for Capricorn regarding how this person is thinking or feeling at this time. The other insight into how this person is thinking or feeling about Capricorn at this time. Not now. So that's that wheel reversed. Something's just not the right time right now. Or maybe your person's not taking action right now. Oh, okay, I love you just popped out. What else? One more card, please. That is way too many. I want one. <laughs> one more card, please, for Capricorn. Give us some insight, Spirit, into how this person's thinking or feeling about Capricorn at this time. Some insight, please, to how Capricorn is thinking or feeling at this time. I want to work this out. Okay, that's that Magician card. They're working on something that is related to you here or manifesting something. So let's get into this. We're going to look at their true intentions and what potential actions they'll take towards you. 
Let's start with their true intentions. Spirit, what is this person's true intentions when it comes to Capricorn or this connection? What is this person's true intentions when it comes to Capricorn or this connection? I'm using a deck by Barbara Moore. So let's see. What are your person's true intentions? What are their true intentions towards Capricorn? Oh my gosh, Ace of Swords reversed again. First card out here. What are their true intentions towards Capricorn? Ten of Swords, yikes. Not getting the best energy here, guys. What are this person's true intentions when it comes to Capricorn? What are their true intentions? The Empress Reverse. The Empress Reverse. I have the Seven of Swords Reverse at the bottom here. Your person, I feel like... Um, Either they've hurt you in the past or they're hurting you right now. Their intention is to still deceive you or um, it's almost like the, the, the way that they speak or communicate or the way that they handle the situations leading to an ending. And I don't know if that's on purpose or what, but I feel like they're going to leave an empress behind here or they're not going to be able to manifest what they want because of the, the their approach. So let's see. What potential actions will they take towards Capricorn? Spirit, what potential actions will they take? Potential actions will they take here? like whatever they're manifesting is not going to work out because of the way they're manifesting something. What potential actions will this person take towards Capricorn? I'm going to clarify all of these, but I want to set these down first. Potential actions. High Priestess Reverse. So something's coming to light here. Maybe they're finally speaking up. Potential, potential actions, please, towards Capricorn. Five of Wands. Yeah, it's like they're going to create drama or conflict. Or participate in drama or conflict. Potential actions, please. For Capricorn. Interesting. Strength. Leo energy here. Interesting. Very interesting. Bottom of the deck, Knight of Wands. So your person is having courage to go after something here. However, I feel like whatever the action is, it's going to be a surprise or it's going to cause drama. I wonder if this Ten of Swords is related to you then. Is this uh, an ending that's happening between you and this person? Or that this person's doing, having an ending in their life of some sort. Let's clarify this. Spirit, help me clarify these energies for Capricorn. Let me clarify, please, these energies for Capricorn. Something's going on with this Ace of Swords reverse. Feel free to look up the Ace of Swords reverse meaning online. There's a lot that goes into it, but basically, it's destruction. Um, lack of success, bad communication, and deception. It's basically what it boils down to. So let's get into this Ace of Swords reverse up here. What's this Ace of Swords about, Spirit? This Ace of Swords reverse, what can you tell us? Justice, Page of Swords reverse. Again, with the deception, there's something that your person is not telling you or is just, they're deceiving you in some way. Now, I don't know if this is deception that they are trying to correct with the Justice card. 
I don't know, they're trying to t maybe tell the truth about a deception. This could be something like they're hiding how they truly feel or hiding their real motives, something like that. Libra energy with the justice card, by the way. But, you know, it's almost like um, someone here, and I think it's your person because this is how they feel. Um, it's like they want to balance the scales, have things be right and fair again. Um, I think it's going to be harder than they think because I have the Wheel of for, uh, re Fortune reversed here. And when the Wheel of Fortune is reversed, it's almost like time just stops. Um, it's not the right time. So you keep like meeting like with obstacles. Tell me about the Magician. What's this about? Funny, Ace of Swords reverse clarified, which is deception clarified by more deception, but then justice. Could be a legal situation as well. Um, but what I'm seeing here is someone wanting to be objective and logical and truthful now. We'll see. Tell me about the magician. Why is the magician here? Three of Cups. So I think your person is manifesting a reunion of some sort, a coming together of some sort. Bottom of the deck, I have the Ace of Pentacles, definitely. This is what they want to do, want to work things out. Tell me about the wheel reverse. Why is the wheel reverse? The lovers reverse. Bad choice. I feel like your person is, is choosing the wrong path or making the wrong choice. Maybe they've already done this. Um, maybe they've already chosen wrong and it's causing this wheel to be reversed. Or it could be that, you know, they need to make a different choice here. Gemini energy with the lovers. Can I get one more for the wheel reverse? This could be a choice in partner. It could be a breakup as well. Some sort of separation. But it's mainly the lovers is about a choice between what your mind is telling you and what your heart is telling you. Tell me about the wheel reverse. Six of swords. So there was a separation here. Someone left their partner. And I think whoever left, um, it was, it, they're either, this could be two ways. Take it as it resonates. Either someone left a partnership and it was the wrong choice, or or moving on is a wrong is the bad choice. Interesting. Sorry that I like pause there. This Six of Swords, okay, yeah. Five of Cups reverse. The Six of Swords is someone leaving to get something back that they've lost because they recognize they've made the wrong choice here um, and that their actions have caused consequences that now your person's trying to like manifest a way out of, if that makes sense. So let's get down here. Let's, let's break this down. Tell me more about this Ace of Swords reverse down here. Spirit, what is this Ace of Swords reverse down here? Can't believe we got this card twice. Five of Cups reverse, Nine of Cups. Interesting. I feel like your person was deceptive because they were thinking of themselves. They could be wanting to to have a, you know they they could be making a wish here that they want to recover what was lost with the Five of Cups. And whatever was lost here was because of deception. So it could be that. What's at the bottom here? The moon. Interesting. Pisces energy. Um, this is all that, you know, hidden. Um, what's beneath the surface. Um, illusion, confusion, doubt. The shadow side. So I feel like there's something here that you don't know about. Capricorn. I think it has to do with someone's wish here. You like you don't like you don't know someone's motives. This Ace of Swords reverse could be that someone's not not communicating or 
you know, lying through a mission. Basically, you don't know that this is happening. It could, but again, I, for some reason, this Ace of Swords reverse to me is like a big factor in all of this. So it could have started with deception, but it's moved to something else here. Can I get one more for this Ace of Swords reverse? Get one more for this Ace of Swords reverse. Eight of Pentacles. Interesting. Someone's focused, working hard, putting an effort into getting their wish. Again, this magician energy. But I have the full reverse. So it's like a, the approach. The approach is not the best. Um, someone's not looking where they're stepping. They're possibly going to take a risk here that's reckless or are just being very naive about the situation. Tell me about the Ten of Swords. That's the Ten of Swords here. Wheel of Fortune reversed again. about the Ten of Swords? It's like, it's like confirmation. Whatever this person is trying to return to here, if this is returning to you, which I think it is, it's like not going to work. It's like they want to return to something that has ended. Tell me more about the Ten of Swords. This could be a betrayal as well. Yeah, Six of Cups reverse. This is someone that's not over the past, not over what happened in the past. Almost like obsessed about this. There you are, Capricorn, devil energy. Or the devil is Capricorn energy. It's like your person has not been able to let you go and doesn't know how to get you back. Tell me about the Empress reverse. Why is the Empress reverse here? Four of Swords reversed. I want this one too. Ten of Wands reversed. Your person is restless, um, unable to stay silent anymore. This is a burden for them, what, what they're not able to grow or manifest. I'm also wondering, you know, for some of you there that are watching this, your person wanting to get you back and work this out, I feel like their intentions behind that is not the best intention. That's for some of you out there where it's like your person wants to return to you, but maybe something didn't work out where they're currently at. Maybe they want to take advantage of the situation. Maybe it's because you're available. You know what I mean? There's something about this that could be off here. So be very careful. Use your intuition because something here is coming to the light with the High Priestess reverse. Whatever this moon energy was up here, I feel like it's going to be revealed. This is your person's actions. I think their actions will reveal something about them. Okay. Tell me about this High Priestess reverse. Why is the High Priestess reverse here? Move this over. Where's the High Priestess reverse? What's coming out here? King of Pentacles. Someone here could be in a commitment. Tell me about the High Priestess reverse. Three of Swords reverse. Yeah, there could be a third party here. Some sort of interference is going to come to light. And there's the moon once again. There's something off here, Capricorn. Be very careful. And this is your person's action. So what's this um, five of wands about? Oops. What's this five of wands about? What's this five of wands about? Seven of pentacles. This is five of wands about. It's like there's conflict between you or conflict surrounding this connection, and someone's wondering if they're they're gonna be able to resolve this. 
hangman, thinking, a lot of thinking here, pondering with the hangman and the seven of pentacles. Um, the hangman is seeing something in a new light here. And I have the two of wands at the bottom, so it's like, which path do I choose to deal with this conflict? To, to make it so that my investment will grow, that something will grow here, will manifest. Because I think whatever your person's trying is, not, is causing more problems, not fixing it. And it could be because through their actions or their behavior, you know, they're not, they're not making the best choices. And so it's getting them into trouble. What's the strength card about down here? strength about star reverse the situation seems hopeless someone's losing faith losing hope knight of cups reverse and they're going to just resort to whatever it takes yeah seven of swords at the bottom 